The build-up has been intense, and now we're just about ready to go. Make no mistake, the world is watching. It's the CONMEBOL Libertadores final. My name is Derek Ray, and joining me as always here on the commentary box is Stuart Robson. You can guarantee we're in for something special. It's Boca Juniors, and they take on River Plate. Well, here we are, Derek, and what an occasion. The atmosphere is incredible. It's the perfect setting for these two teams to demonstrate their quality. What a final this should be. A look then at the starting 11. Well, if the players at the side of the diamond don't tuck in when they lose possession and the number 10 doesn't recover, the holding midfield player could be in for a really difficult game today. This is what they'll be facing today. Well, this system gives them a good defensive base. A well-drilled back four, a solid midfield with wide players tucking in, and two forwards who can press the ball. But does it provide enough fluidity going forward? I'm never sure. And this confrontation is underway. Excellent ball over the top. And he's in. Teammate available. Oh, wonderful save. Well, he reacts so quickly there. That's a great save. And Perez now. Fluency of movement. Well, this could pose problems for the defenders. And he didn't hesitate. Good thing too. Well, he's so quick off his line. That's great goalkeeping, you have to say. And he's got the beating of his opponent. Oh, he's through here. Oh, a save of the highest order. Well, he got his angles absolutely right. What a good save that is. Playing it in, no nonsense clearance. Angileri, Palavasino. Could cross it in here. Surely! Real chance. Oh, there's the goal! There's the opener! How about that? Well, just watch this again. It's a really good goal, but it's no surprise, is it? They've been in complete control here. So the ball rolling again with the score. Alvarez keeping it moving dynamically. Must be! And there it is! A two-goal cushion now! And just look at these fans! The trophy coming their way, surely! Well, let's look at this again. The one and two touch passing is absolutely outstanding to play around the pressure. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. 
What an emphatic finish that is. So 2-0 now. Can they create something from here? He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Medina. On the offensive. for the angle and oh it's in we cannot declare this contest over they still believe well here it is again the build-up is so patient they're just waiting to play that killer pass at the right time and he makes no mistake with the finish he showed a lot of composure there So on with the match. 2-1 is the scoreline. What's going to happen next? Brian Romero. Here's Alvarez. Enzo Perez. Will he find the net? He had to react and did. Now the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again. And throw in. So a personnel change then. Palavasino. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. That's a fairly easy save for any keeper to make. Campuzano. Orsini on the ball. Good technique displayed. Almendra. Not getting anxious when they have the ball. Defensive efficiency personified. And looks very real. Showing patience, looking for the equaliser. He's protecting it well. A corner will ensue. has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes and now both sides will make personnel switches who can he pick out well, capable of better looking confident with the ball at his feet could be threatening well, just the tackle that was needed teammates to play it to making progress pulls it back now well, tremendous block and players waiting in the centre will he finish and it's come off the keeper 
Well, and the new kings of the Copa Libertadores have been crowned. As we salute the winners, we must at the same time commiserate with the losers. An emotional occasion. The bottom line is, they've done it. Well, you're absolutely right, Derek. Contrasting emotions down there, but this is all about the winners. Just look at the jubilation. Joy, relief, excitement, call it what you want. They've been brilliant today, and they deserve this moment. And they put so much work into this campaign. It has paid off. And now for the walk every player in South America wants to make. Awaiting them, that piece of sterling silver, and their name will shortly be on the pedestal. Well, as they make their way up to get this cut, they look tired, but you wait. In a couple of moments, they'll be jumping for joy. Suddenly, that energy will come back. What a moment for these players. River Plate, the winners of the Copa Libertadores. Well, it's been a great effort. Everybody has played their part and fully deserved this. They've been outstanding in what is a tough competition. Great stuff. One more trophy left. Why not? Yes. And there is absolutely nothing like drinking it all in with your own fans. Well, what is great to see, Derek, the players and the fans have a great bond, don't they? And it's brilliant for these supporters. They were so vocal today. They certainly played their part. Magnificent scenes. These celebrations will run long into the night. And now for the pictures that they'll be looking at for the rest of their lives. Yeah, these will be shown to the grandkids for years to come. Fantastic stuff, isn't it? The Libertadores victors.